new this morning, a big project at Glenver High School has the community buzzing. Students are using products from a beehive on campus to make lip balm and soap, and they're selling it to local stores. 10 News reporter Aaron Brookshire joins us live this morning from Glenver. So, Aaron, how long has this project been going on? Well, based off of the success and the community response, you'd think it's a project that's been going on for a while now, but it's only been a couple of months since students here at Glenver started harvesting the wax from the bees here at the school to make this lip balm and soap that they've been selling to students. Seeing it come from there, turning it into the beeswax and the beeswax going into the final products, it's really interesting to watch. It's a project that started at the beginning of the year with Charlie Filer's ecology club or ecology students making the lip balm and his science club students working on the soap. Students say it's amazing being able to put their books down and get their hands dirty while learning about reactions, beehives as a form of agriculture and other important lessons. Being able to make the soap and being able to use the lye and really see it happen right in front of you and like you're the one that's doing it, it's really cool. When I ask them to do something that's more hands-on, they usually get pretty excited about it. Uh, and this one just really flourished. It, it, students who uh, didn't have the best grades tend to be the, the ones who responded the best to it and, and did absolutely outstanding. So it was, it was really rewarding to see them step up and do such a great job on these projects. It's a hands-on learning approach that students say they're proud to be a part of, now selling the GB lip balm and soap at a handful of stores in the Glenver community. Each project works to fund the next one. Filer was able to pay for the supplies for the soap and lip balm with proceeds from pepper jelly made from peppers grown in the school's greenhouse back in the fall. They've now broken even on the lip balm, which means all of the money that's made from selling these products is now going into account that will fund future science projects here at Glenver High School. Live in Roanoke County, I'm Erin Brookshire, 10 News working for you.